Hi, Jesse Nebulous here. Welcome back to Ark Survival Evolved, where that Bronto is having some troubles. He's stuck in that rock. The struggle is real, folks. Anyway, I have a new family member to introduce you to if this parasaur would get out of my way. Out of here. Nobody likes you. Ugh. Anyway, this is Spike. He's been helping me gather metal so I can make tools and stuff. And I have leveled up and I was able to get the saddle for the Pteranodon. I haven't done much exploring yet. I wanted to wait and do that in an episode. But I do have to show you I found a very rare creature indeed. Yes, I found one of the rarest creatures in all of Ark. The elusive winged rock. Majestic. All jokes aside, I wonder if I can uh, help you out there. There you go. Fly free. You're welcome. Okay, what I want to do is I want to go over to the White Cliffs because I haven't really done that yet. Because I this is my first flyer. And I think I want to tame a Jerboa. That's what I want to do. I need a I need a pet. I'm I'm lonely. It's lonely on the Ark. There's a lot of butt in this picture right now. Much ass. Who is a better ass? Me or the Pteranodon? Pretty sure it's me. Though. I mean, because it's hers is all pointy. Anyway. Where would one find a Jerboa? Oh, a bunch of aloes. Fighting Ankies. Get them, Ankies! Oh, that's a 116 Allosaurus. Yeah, you guys are toast. And there's a Rex trying to climb in that Bronto's ass. That's what that looks like. Is that Rex fighting a Raptor? Do they usually fight? That Rex took down... I mean, that Raptor took down the Rex. I'm impressed. Wonder what level it is. He's just picking fights with everybody. That's a 116 Raptor. Fighting with the 116. Who's gonna win? Oh, no. Did they team up? No, that Raptor just hates everybody. He's just biting at their ankles. Interesting. I want that raptor. Oh, oh, I found a Jerboa, but I don't really feel particular. Can I pick you up? I can pick you up. I'll take you with me. I mean, it doesn't really look like I'm picking it up because it's swinging way below me, but hey. Come here, little guy. Oh, that's not what I meant at all. Okay, do not run off the cliff. Just let me punch you. Good job. I don't have berries. Crap. Came here with a specific thing to do. And I wasn't even prepared. And I think their torpor or whatever runs out very quickly. Yeah, it does. Get out of the way, Vivian. You're going to ruin the moment. There we go. And I won't name it quite yet because I don't know what I want to name her. Oh, you're a hungry girl, too. You were a girl, weren't you? Yes. Well, let's take a look at you. Oh, you're so cute! You're adorable. Okay. Now we've got a friend. I feel better about things. Alright, let's go. And I figure I'll just kind of look around, see what I can see. Because maybe I can tame something. Oh, you're a pretty horse. I don't have any carrots. I should go get carrots. I know where to get carrots on this map, too. Of 
course, how would I get it home? Oh, you're cute. You're cuter than the one I have. I want to take you home with me. What are you? Are you a girl or a boy? Can I breed you guys? That would be fun. You're a male. Oh. Jeez, your poops are big for your size. I like you, too. I like every... I like all these things. I, like, I want to tame all the things. That's a pretty decent dodecarus. I don't have any cryo balls, though. Or cryo... Cryopods. Um, I'm probably just going to end up cheating them in because I don't even know how you make them. I think they're really involved and you might have to beat a boss or something. And none of that's happening. I don't do that. It's not why I play ARC. <laughs> Some Dinococcus. We're not involved, interested in those. Not in the market for those guys just yet. If ever. I mean, I might. They're cool. They're just pain to get. 69. Obligatory. Oh, yeah. I really could use a Dodecarus. I might go back and tame that other one. Maybe I should go get some carrots first while I'm thinking of it. When I say I know where they are, I know roughly where they are. It's been a while. I'd be interested in go getting an RG. I'm not sure what level the saddle unlocks at, though. I want to say it's like 62. Something like, somewhere around there. What level am I at? I'm at 46, so yeah. I've got a ways to go before I get an, uh, an RG saddle. I mean, I don't necessarily need to ride the RG for it to be useful. It can carry things for me. And just be protection. Because we don't really have a protective uh, dino yet. Okay, so... The carrots? Oh, I think those are the carrots. I believe these are carrots. Well, you're awfully big and rude. Yes. I'm gonna just collect all these and go back over there, and if I find a horse in an ideal spot, I'll give it a try. Get out of my face. So rude. I want to check out and see, check out the saber tooth. I would like to get a saber tooth. Because I unlocked the engram and I do love me some saber tooths. Aside from a thylacolio, saber tooths are one of my favorite mounts. I love the thylacolio, but that's much later. I have to get like an RG and all that stuff. I mean, you don't have to. There are ways around it, but it, it's more difficult, and I don't think I want to deal do it that way. I'll just get an RG. I don't even feel safe going into the Redwoods without an Argent. <laughs> Argent Davis. And eventually, I do want to build in the White Cliffs, I believe. Not sure where yet. So when do those carrots spoil? Oh, they're spoiling. They spoil fast. Well... After we look at the saber tooths, maybe we'll go back over and see about horses. Oh, I see some saber tooths. Well, you suck. Yeah, none of you are impressive so far. So far, I've been very disappointed. What I usually do to get saber tooths is I build a trap down here. And just lead them to it. <laughs> kind of hoping to find a horse down here. Because I really don't want to have to tame up in the white cliffs if I don't have to. It's, ugh. Freaking moths. I hate the noise they make. It just grosses me out. Okay, I found a horse. Be a good level. I mean, you're kind of a boring brown, but if you're a high level, I'll take you. You're 11. 11. You should be embarrassed. See, the problem with trying to tame horses here is, like, if you find one up here, it's all good and well. But when you're on them and you're actually doing the taming minigame, they'll fly off and just run off the side and take you careening towards the aloes and raptors and dinococcus. Rexes, everything. All the dangers. 
I probably should have found the horse I wanted and then got the carrots. But that sounds like planning, and I don't do that. That's for other people. I might just tame the Stodicarus and call it good. Because she is pretty cool, and I do need one. I will have to cheat in some cryopods, though, because there's no other way to get her home. Hey there, Jaboas. Do they all have bright blue eyes, or is mine just special? Do you have bright blue eyes? Let me see. Yeah, you do. Yeah, they do. Okay. I mean, mine's still special because it's mine. We're going to go through here and just double check that there's no threats. Okay. Looks pretty good. It's too bad you're a low level because you're pretty cool looking. Okay. You stay up here, Vivian. And I believe I have absolutely plenty of these. The last time I tried this, it just curled up into a ball and I couldn't uh, tame it. So hopefully that doesn't happen this time. You know you want to be my friend. Don't even pretend otherwise. I do have to be careful not to go flying off this cliff, though. By accident. Just backing up like this. I might also tame that other Draboa and pop it into a cryo ball. Yeah, I know. You don't like me. I don't like you either because your level sucks. See? And now I can't tame her. Because I don't think you can... Because it looks like I'm hitting her, like, head. Or wherever. But no matter what I do, she's not going to go down. See? I don't understand. How do you tame these things? Maybe you just have to use darts because they do less actual damage. Yeah, I guess I'll just come back with darts. Whenever I get darts. That's just so disappointing. Well, I'll tame you. You look like a skeleton. You're cool. Oh, you take a beating like a champ, too, for a little, little gerboa. There you go. This will be your new friend. Look at the little feet. It's just splayed. It's adorable. I'll have to pick out names for these two. You guys are so cute. Too bad I can't have one on each shoulder. Why didn't that work? Is it just not close enough? Oh, sorry, buddy. Why won't it work? There we go. It's hard to aim on those small animals. And I guess we'll keep going and try to find something else we want to tame. Since we can't tame that, it's just not in the cards right now. Draboas are everywhere. If you guys weren't so cute, I'd say that you're like infesting the place. What's your level? You're about to get spooked by me anyway. Oh, I need to put my thing back. Sixty-six? That's definitely better, but for the uh, amount of risk you take. Ooh, a black sheep. Are you the black sheep of your family? Um, for the risk you take for a horse, I mean, and for the pain in the ass that it is, I want a high level. That's a decent Rex. I would tame that Rex because it's cool. I like the colors. It's a decent level. 
Alright, let's look around for another a horse in a better spot. High level, good spot. That's what we're looking for. Though, is anywhere around here a good spot? I don't think so. Oh, level 100. You'd be perfect. But I'm not taming anything right here. It's scary right here. Oh, I didn't mean to land. I didn't mean to land. Go! <laughs> this is a terrifying place. I don't know where I'm going to build here. <laughs> and then there's down here, like, the Dinococcus areas with the eggs in them. I could totally steal some Dinococcus eggs. There's one right there. Am I... I'm scared. <laughs> they're, they're right there. They'd be on me too quick. See, I could build somewhere like here. It's up on a platform. I mean, I could do that right now for... I mean, for the fact that... Nothing can get to me. But until I have an Argent to actually fly my guys back and forth. I mean, I could just cryobomb, but that's a pain in the butt to do. See, I love this area. I think it's just so pretty. This looks like a cave opening. I have heard that the modded version of this has caves and stuff. More caves and stuff. And that there's actually a cave somewhere around here. I might have to get the modded version. I don't do any mods for the most part. I just... Vanilla is fine for me. For most... For the most part. Oh, I hate that moth sound. It freaks me out. It's like, why'd they have to make them sound so gross? I mean, granted, some of the moths are kind of pretty, but it's just that sound. Yeah, I see you. Move, you're taking a poop. It's not a good time. It's a little scary that they can't take off when they're, out, when they're pooping. Because sometimes you need to get out of dodge, and they're just like, nope, gotta have a BM. Poop isn't worth dying for. I think I'll go over to the edge of the redwood. See if I find anything interesting there. You gotta be careful when going by the redwoods. Because thylacolios are a thing. Now poor Bronto is just struggling. Okay everyone. We have some new members of the family. We have... Oh, I never named them. <laughs> is that the sound of someone standing in my fire? I think it is. <laughs> Super cute. Everyone, this is Mickey and Minnie. Newest members of the family. Whose poops are the same size as them, essentially. Okay. So I think that's it for one episode. Thank you for joining me. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, you can always leave me a like or a comment. And let me know. That would be really awesome. And you can always subscribe for more. That would be even more awesome. So thanks again. I'm Jesse Nebulous. Bye.